and one of the focuses in my laboratory is kidney cancer research. Kidney cancer is a devastating disease. It occurs in over 63,000 men and women in the United States with over 13,000 deaths. I'm Christina Von Romeling. I'm currently a graduate student in Dr. Copeland's lab here at the Mayo Clinic in Jacksonville, Florida. Some of my projects that I'm working on currently deal with identifying new targets for therapy in clear cell renal cell carcinoma, which is a really deadly disease when it reaches ad advanced and metastatic phases, for which currently there is no cure. 31 genes to be overexpressed in promoting growth and metastasis in kidney cancer. These are other genes that desperately need to be explored as potential new therapeutic targets as well. On top of that, these genes can be biomarkers. That is, some of these genes, like NPTX2, are specifically expressed in this common form of kidney cancer called clear cell renal cell carcinoma. Each of these genes that we found appear to be playing several different roles and may be involved in recruiting blood vessels which provide a food source for the tumors. They also might be involved in promoting the metastatic capabilities of these tumors and so they're involved in many different signaling pathways in these tumors and the hope is that we might be able to create drugs that can inhibit the activity of these pro-cancerous proteins um, either to be used as a therapy on their own or possibly be used in combination with some of the therapies that are currently being used in the clinic. By sharing our discoveries of these new cancer genes, our hope is that the scientific community will develop new therapies for kidney cancer as well as other cancers. We really want to try to come up with therapies that don't cause significant th side effects. Some of the drugs that we use today often make patients very, very sick and so it's really important for us as researchers that we find ways to effectively treat them while preserving the quality of their life. Without research, there will be no cure.